Are you tired of watching boring old press releases? Then you've come to the right place, the right channel, the number one channel for CEO interviews and company overviews. Welcome to Rich TV Live. Subscribe to our channel and make sure to hit the like button on our videos to help with the YouTube algorithm. For more information and in-depth discussions and analysis, join our trading club at richpigsdaily.com. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for notifications to get alerted when our next CEO interview is released so you can discover the next 10 bagger. Hi, how's everybody doing today? I'm your host, Rich, and we have Rich TV Live with our very special guest, Hamutal Yitzak, the CEO of Else Nutrition. How are you doing today, Hamutal? Hi, I'm doing very well. I'm very happy to be back, and uh, thank you for having me. Always a pleasure. I'm a big fan of Else Nutrition. Not only have you done extremely well as a stock, but the company is doing great work, especially for toddlers and infants and children. Now, for a little recap, Else Nutrition is a food and nutrition company that has developed clean and plant-based products for infants, children, and adults. Since we last spoke, what's new with Else Nutrition? So yeah, it's a uh, you know it's, it's quite difficult to recap everything in a in two sentences because it's been a lot. It's been a while. I think we last spoke in November, so it yep. was uh, just um, a couple months after our launch of the Toddler Nutrition. So since then, we've seen very fast growth on our e-com and uh, and platforms, as well as um, started selling on the retail space and. and there we see very nice growth, but it's just the beginning. We started on February and um, we've um, expanded our team in Israel as well in the North America uh, quite dramatically. We have a very, very strong team in so many spaces and we're building a new team in North America for expansion uh, and marketing with HCPs and uh, all kinds of stuff is happening. We're trying to locate um, a new capacity for um, production in Europe as well in the States. So many things are happening concurrently and working very hard on the clinical side. So I suggest we dive into the details and um, speak in the, and get into, in, into its question so I can uh, really provide more information. Great. Hamutal, Else just announced some impressive first quarter results at the end of May. Can you tell us about the company's progress in Q1? Sure. So um, the revenue growth that we reported in Q1 uh, are based on the fast growth on our online sales, as well as the first large orders that we got from distributors that serve the retail space. Uh, so we've seen, for example, we've seen... Um, over 1.1 million Canadian um, and dollars, uh, which represents about 90% growth over the revenues of the fourth quarter in 2020. And we've seen an increase of about 300% versus the revenues of our first quarter in 2020. Wow. And it's, it was the first quarter to recognize the formula revenues from the retail market. And, and with the formula revenues specifically, we've seen 150% growth and quarter over quarter um, of about 900,000 uh, Canadian versus uh, 350 uh, in the fourth quarter of 2020. We've also seen um, an increase in the number of orders or in the, um, of 66% from Amazon and, and an average basket increase um, of 15% quarter over quarter. So this is our, these are the major numbers from, from Q1. I, I love like that. that. Everything is growing. Everything, every number is growing. All your numbers are growing. Right. So that's right. really, really good news for investors and for the company. Now, the company has also grown its online sales. You touched on it a little bit there. Can you tell us a little bit more about your online sales? Sure. So Elle started uh, its U.S. online sales in August 2020, as you remember. And yes. it was um, first uh, introduced on our e-store. And, and later in September, it was introduced on Amazon.com. And 
I think two months of, uh, after that, on November, we were already ranked bestseller on Amazon uh, infant and toddler nutrition new releases, which is quite exciting. And so the initial online sales on these two channels, our e-store and Amazon, demonstrate a, a very, very um, good trajectory uh, of growth. We're growing over um, 20% month over month. And we're also expected to accelerate this because we are introducing more products into, into the virtual shelf and into the shelf um, uh, in general. Uh, we've just seen our previous launch uh, a few days ago of uh, the Kids Nutrition Drink, and there will be many more. Um, and just one more figure, the Amazon sales are uh, actually doubling every three months. This is also quite exciting. Super exciting yeah. growth. I love to see growth. and We love to see revenue. That is always the biggest catalyst for any company. With the plant-based industry growing so rapidly, can you tell us what, where you see Else Nutrition one year from now? I think in a year's time, there will be so many different things uh, with, with the case of Else. I mean, we definitely will see um, many new retailers listings and launches. We are currently in discussions with about, I mean, with dozens of retailers that represent around 5,000 additional doors. Currently, wow. we're listed uh, on 900 doors since February, and we're selling already in 600 of them. So I, I think that um, towards um, the next, I mean, in a, in a year's time, we'll be seeing uh, thousands of doors for else. Um, we'll also be looking at Canada. I mean, looking in terms of bringing... Um, product that's compliant to the Canadian regulation. And uh, currently we're just shipping to Canada, but we do not comply to the regulation. So we can't sell in Canada. And um, there'll be many new product launches in terms of new product series, uh, product lines. And um, some of them will be catering uh, babies from six months already. That means a, a very long term um, life like the value of, of, of each client because loyalty is the name of the game here. Um, and there will be um, penetration to new geographies, which we're working on. One of them is Europe as well. Um, and we're working on China. Uh, that will be, I think, in the second part of the next year. Um, I think there will be results coming from the clinical study. So we will be able to have claims on certain products, which are clinical claims and all sorts of things. Yeah. That sounds great. Sounds like you guys are on the right track. And obviously the plant-based industry has grown so much. When we started talking a couple of years ago, almost two years ago to the day now, I remember it was like the beginning of the plant-based industry. Now there's so many other companies getting into the plant-based industry and you guys are almost veterans now of the plant-based industry. Right. So it's exciting to see the evolution. Now at the beginning of spring this year, Else Nutrition signed deals with two massive US distributors. Can you tell us more about Else Nutrition's growing presence in the United States and what these milestones mean for the company? And are there any other strategic partnerships you'd like to highlight? Sure. So first of all, we, we did onboard and already are shipping products through those two major distributors, the largest in, uh, in North America, UNFI and Kagi. Great. And um, together, both of them are covering um, almost the entire retail market in the U.S., wow. which is about 60,000. I mean, altogether, they cover about 60,000 doors, which are potential doors for else expansion. That's incredible. And they already opened 14 of their distribution centers uh, for else, which is quite amazing. Um, com considering the, the very uh, short time that we are um, operating together. Um, so I think that means a lot for ELSE in terms of trust, in terms of um, the fact that these two um, major distributors actually, um, it, it, it means credibility, it means trust in the product, trust in the company, trust in our capabilities to supply, to, to support the supply chain, to grow um, and they've also uh, onboarded us to, I mean, Kehi onboarded us to their Elevate um, program, which means supporting uh, a growth, a high growth brand in everything that has to do with their platform and systems. We were selected uh, amongst thousands of brands 
into a very, very unique and uh, exclusive program with them. So that means a lot to us. And so the retail sales started very early February in Sprouts Farmer's Market, which is a competitor of Whole Foods with 350 doors. And then um, we expanded into several additional natural food and grocery retailers and independent stores. So as I said, and we have Big Y, Rayleigh's and uh, natural grocers, it, it was 160 doors and AFS, which represents 300 potential doors and many, many more. So currently we're, we're listed on 900, as I said, and already selling to 600. And that is ongoing on an ongoing trajectory for growth all the time. Wow. And are there any other strategic partnerships that you'd like to highlight at this point that you maybe are working on or you guys are planning to put yeah, together? So um, there are. We are okay. currently negotiating at least two strategic partnerships, very major ones, but you know, we're negotiating. So wow. I really cannot disclose that at this moment, but um, stay tuned. And uh, <laughs> one more thing that I, I maybe forgot to mention that we are also international. I mean, we are, yes. we have been listed and already started selling on iHerb, which is um, a major international platform, online platform that serves um, actually consumers from 180 uh, countries. Wow. So I mean, potentially we're available all over the world for every mom that wants to purchase the brand. It's just a matter of, you know, awareness and marketing. And we intend to be very active on that platform as well. Very good. Wow. You guys have really grown and uh, it's exciting to watch the evolution. You really recently announced, and this was the news that uh, we were looking at today and we were talking about and we we're breaking on Rich TV Live today. You recently announced the launch of a second product, a nutrition shake for kids age three and up. What has been the market response so far? And do you have any other products coming down the pipeline this year? Sure. So, I mean, to be honest, so the, the kids nutrition drink was just announced today officially yes. uh, in a PR, but um, so it was soft launched a few days ago and it's a very short time to, to tell what's the market response. But for, as far as we see now that the velocity was quite, quite impressive. And we, Good. we see um, from reviews from the, the few reviews that we have seen from consumers that they're quite happy with our taste and solubility even, I mean, despite the fact that our, our sugar levels are very low compared to our leading competitors, and that's that's something we're very proud of. I mean, having a great taste with a very low level of sugar, and um, so we see we see great responses for now. But let's let's be patient and and look for more valid and, and solid uh, responses and uh, from the market. Do you have any other products coming down the pipeline this year that you guys are working yeah, on? Yeah, so for sure. So as I, as I already mentioned, there are several product lines that are coming into the market this year already. Already, Some of them are already produced, but um, are in different stages of packaging or uh, ready to go to live uh, to the market. And um, I'm talking about a series for six months babies, whether it is um, a complementary nutrition product with high protein. Um, I'm talking about... Um, liquid product that will be by the end of the year or the beginning of the next one. And, and um, we're talking about different products for different territories, because as you said, as I said, regulation is different in every country. So you have to adapt and you have to create a different, a slightly different product for each, each country, but mainly these are the major product lines that will be um, available very soon. On top of the kids' nutrition that has just been launched, and there will be many SKUs additionally with different flavors and uh, all different kinds of uh, additives, um, you know, immune boosting and all these kinds of additives that we add on a natural basis to those products. So there'll be multiple SKUs for else. Wow. It's been a wild year so far. We're already into June. We're six months into the year. We're halfway through the year almost. What can we look forward to for Else Nutrition? I know you guys have been super busy. Can we look forward to anything in the next coming months for the rest of this year? Yeah, so I think um, I think whatever I've already described here is a lot to wait for. I mean, yes. we're looking at new territories, new product lines. 
I mean, expansion, 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 all in, in, in so many, you know, facets and aspects. Um, we're looking at um, new claims, as I said, clinical claims, which will also accelerate growth and um, attractiveness of our products with new, you know, customers and, and new um, audiences all over the world. Um, what, what I can tell you about something new that's really, really happening, and uh, I, I'm not sure I've mentioned that, is that parents are actually um, speaking about amazing things that our product is doing to their babies. And they've, ch- they've actually tried everything that's in the market. I mean, cow's milk or soy, which is whatever, whatever it is in the market, there's nothing else. And nothing helped in cases of allergenicity or intolerance or all kinds of irritations. And they're speaking about healing effects of our product for their babies, and they're so thankful. So we see great future for that company just because of that. And um, that's the most important thing that I have to say for, for our investors and for our customers. That, that actually creates the, the, base, the basis for success for, for a brand because you see that the product really provides and really, really creates, makes a difference, makes a difference and, and changes lives. For, for so many families. I agree 100%. As a father myself, I wish this product was around when my children were babies. My kids are teenagers now, so uh, not as much of a focus uh, with this product for teenagers as it is for toddlers, but your products are also for adults as well, right? So your products are pretty much covering everybody now from infants yeah, and I mean, babies yeah, all the way to adults. Launched, uh, yeah, yeah. We, we haven't launched adult products, but we are working on that to get there um, hey. when we, when company decides that it's the right time to. Oh, currently, we're trying to focus on on the young young child uh, nutrition, but definitely we are working to create additional um, you know lines for adults. That's great. And that I- would make the same difference for them. I'm sure of that. I think that's a great idea. Now, there's going to be investors all over the world that are going to see this interview that are going to ask questions. What's the best way for them to get in contact with you? Well, I think I'm very responsive on email, so it'll be the best way to get me. Um, so, um, yeah, and, and else care, our info uh, emails, we have a great team, very responsive as well. So you can also uh, get in touch through them and they'll forward it to me. Thank you so much for your time today. The CEO of Else Nutrition, Hamutel Yitzak. Keep up all the great work. Every time I speak with you, there's more big news, there's new markets, there's new products, revenue has really grown. Congratulations to getting over that seven-figure mark. And I know that the numbers will only continue to grow. Thank you for your time today, Hamita. Thank you so much, Rit. And uh, looking forward for the next one soon. Thank you so much for your time today, Hamutal. Now, for those of you guys that are watching, remember Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. Please do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in any companies that we talk about. And in saying that, if you like the video, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere, and subscribe. Else Nutrition has been one of our biggest winners. Uh, About two years ago, we started talking with Hamutal when it was at 30 cents. Today, the stock is trading well over $2 in Canada. It's also trading in the United States. So it's been a huge success. It's been as high as $5. So it's been a very big success for our community. So I still believe that this is a company that has a lot of growth potential. And I still believe is undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed, and has an incredible future. So if you guys agree with me, or you'd like to comment on the video, please do so. Otherwise, Thank you guys for watching. Have me tell, keep up all the great work. Look forward to seeing you again soon.